increasingly important word in the atomic and hydrogen age. The facts from federal civil defense tell us that fallout could hurt you, might even kill you. Well, what about it, mister? What is this fallout stuff? Fallout is nothing more than particles of matter in the air made radioactive by nuclear explosions. Sooner or later, however, they settle to Earth. This is fallout. And it can be very dangerous if you don't know what to do about it. Well, do you know what to do about it, Grandpa? Not yet, young man, but I will. There are four major characteristics of an A-bomb or H-bomb explosion. They are blast, heat, initial radiation, and residual radiation. All this... Hey Boston, it's me Vinny, and you're listening to Mod Shop Mayhem, broadcasting to you from a satellite pointed all the way up into space, and then bouncing back to you from the old world radio self-repairing satellites. Man, I love it. I bet people can listen to me back in New York, or maybe even as far as New Vegas. Whether you're a wayward wastelander, the junkie raider, or the gal who doesn't know she's a synth yet, old world tunes and the storyteller have your ear. Crack open a cold Nuka Cola and bask in the music, my friend. Also, if you're the before mentioned Raider, maybe rethink some things. Stay classy, Commonwealth. Huh. I can't believe all of you are listening to my dinky little station when good old Kent's been putting the old silver shroud blaze on the air. Honestly, it's pretty good. More addictive than Psycho. Well, almost. You're listening to Westwalk Radio, broadcasting today for a brighter tomorrow. With me, your host, Susan, 16 times Westwalk Radio Broadcaster of the Year. This is Dusty Dude, and you're listening to Tumbleweed Tunes. I wasn't born with the name Dusty Dude. That was a nickname I earned back in New Vegas when working for the NCR. Funny story on how I was deemed the Dusty Dude. Maybe I'll tell you all about it a few songs later. Hope you people out there staying tuned and staying safe. This is Moses Pendergrass, and you're listening to GNR Boston. Heard a few of you Bostonians been trying to visit me at the GNR building. I cannot stress this enough. Do not, I repeat, do not attempt to go there for I am now at a secret location. 
after being run out of the GNR building by these shitheads calling themselves the Gunners. I don't want to hear about another fool getting shot just because it wants my autograph. It's time to read some GNR fan email. There's been one thing that's been bothering me. I keep getting emails from fans who keep getting me confused with a fellow named Gordon Freeman. Uh, Morgan Lehman. Ah, oh, hell, some nonsense like that. They keep asking about some side of a goddamn wormhole. I tell you what, folks. I'll take you through the wormhole when I put my foot up your ass, motherfucker. This is Isaiah Pendergrass, and you're listening to Cadillac Jack's Radio Shack, straight out of Boston. Uh, that is a good drink. Sorry, I was just enjoying another one of my cocktails here. Hope you're still tuned in to Cadillac Jack's Radio Shack here. If you aren't, then screw you, fuckhead. You don't know what you're missing. Ha! <laughs> You're listening to me on Pocket Rocket. Oops. Nah. You're listening to Red Rocket Radio Bob with me, Johnny Fancy. So I was outside talking to a gal named Trash Can Carla. She's got all kinds of dumb stuff for sale. She had some old comic books, some Rob Coe action figures for sale, and I couldn't help myself. I love toys, boys and girls, and I love comics, especially Grognak the Barbarian. He kills monsters and gets laid all the time. I think he's trying to be yours truly, Bob Shabam. 